Excuse me. All right. For let's let's start with number nine. So we want to tell if it's a function or not. So to determine that, given a graph, I want to use the vertical line test. All right. So I made this nice little bar here to simulate a pencil. If you have a pencil, just use that. Okay. Vertical line test means the function. In order to be a function, it can only hit my line once. So if you go across there, every single time I run this line across. Um, my graph only hits it once. There's no repetition for my x values. All right, so this is a function. Number two should be pretty easy to see. Boom, right away, my, my graph hits, the, or hits my vertical line twice. So no, that is not. All right, since the graph hits the vertical line twice, it is not a function. Let's keep going. All right, state the vertex and match a graph with each function. So y equals x plus 4 quantity squared plus 1. Uh, I think this is like 411 or 412, maybe 410. Um, what was this past one? 410, so this is probably 411 or 12. 411, 411. Okay. Um, so four, uh, x plus 4 squared plus 1. Uh, remember, on the inside of the parentheses, I do the opposite. So the vertex is negative 4. On the outside, it stays the same, comma 1. So I'm going to look for negative 4, 1. Oh, look at that. It's the first one. A. Okay, let's look at number 12. Inside is the opposite, so I have 3. Outside stays the same, comma, negative 2. 3, negative 2 looks like this one down here, and it's opening down since that negative 2. So that is correct. This would be C. All right, next one. Opposite of positive 3 is negative 3. There is a, not a number added on the outside, so I can assume that is 0. So I look for the 1 at 3, comma, 0. Um, doesn't look like any of these are that one. So that's really tough. Um, it should have been B, uh, but we'll just say none about that. I can promise you that um, it will it will it will match up on when it comes to the test. Last one, our possible elimination. I know that this answer is going to be D, but the vertex is going to be three comma four. And I can also tell that by looking at this. Okay. What else? All right. Let's pause there.